Back to local news now. What keeps you up at night? That's the question Lincoln Public Schools officials have been asking themselves for the past two days. The district is one of the first in the country to host a sports event risk management training session. It's to improve their security at school sporting events. Channel 8's Yosef Nasser joins us now with more on that. Yosef. Hey Rod and Megan, we go to high school sporting events to cheer on our schools, but anything can happen at a basketball game or a track meet. Here's how LPS is prepping to make sure you and your children are safe at those events. You always worry about, you know, obviously the, the big ones like um, an active shooter, but you know, the reality of something happening um, at our sporting events is, is probably weather. For the past two days, state law enforcement LPS athletic directors and security officers have been training on how to handle emergency situations at sporting events here in Lincoln. The National Center for Sports Spectator Safety and Security hosted the session. A big piece of the training is having a general plan in place to respond to a wide range of possible emergencies. Our goal is to really kind of stay general and um, give, our, give our staff an outline but train them to be able to respond to multiple scenarios. We often say, you know, you plan for what you know, and then there's also some things that you may not know. Some examples of things discussed in the training course include active shooter scenarios. Evacuating, how do we take people in, how do we take people out, how do we make sure that people come in and it's a safe environment when they come in. Those are all things that they're giving us to make sure that we're looking at. Here in Nebraska, weather-related scenarios are a big thing to account for as well. We're not meteorologists. We don't we don't have that background, so we have to make sure that we have the relationships in place. Other important things discussed include evacuation procedures, responding to someone having a health emergency at a sporting event and crowd management. What really keeps me up at night is making sure that our staff is ready to respond and that that's all the preparation um, part for us. That's that's what we have to prepare for. 